Hi. So I tried out different things in order to not have V-Sync problems. But there's a visual tearing. Didn't work. Yeah, no, we're just going to have to deal with the visual tearing, sadly. But we're picking up where we all left off last time. He really turns it around slowly. And yes, we will be going over to here. We're about to learn a song. Check. There appears to be markings that indicate specific directions. Up left, right. And you learn the Wind's Requiem. So the wind's just gonna blow itself its own way. Mm. Yup, that's a mighty nice breeze. The name's Cephos. I'm the god of winds. So you're the new wind waker, are you? Great, great. For a beginner, you've got a nice wind sense about you. I like you, kid. That tune you just picked up. That tune you just picked up? Well, it gives you control over the direction the wind blows. Depending on how it's used, wind could be a good thing or a very bad thing. You want an example of it being a bad thing? Then you should see my brother. It saddens me to say that my brother, Cyclos, is miffed about his monument here being broken and now he spends his time creating cyclones to torment people with. So if you encounter any cyclones at sea, chastise my brother for me, will you? And that is my request for you. <laughs> yeah, but how do I do that? It's like, do this for me. I'm not gonna tell you how to do it. Just do it for me. Like, thanks, dude. You're a great frog god. I don't really know any other way to put it. Alright. Well, where should we be going next? Let's have a look at the map. Next, we gotta be going south. Wait. This map isn't open. The same from here. What about Tingle? I don't know what this is. What is this? That looks like a fairy, a fairy. Tingle Island, I guess. This is Windfall. Hmm. Either way. I guess we should try here, go south slightly. I just, it would seem that Ganon sent those monsters to this place. That would mean. There's no time to lose. We must depart at once for the place where the next pearl sleeps. We sail to the south. Okay. Uh, how am I supposed to use my grapple with you? Wait, how do I... Let me in. Let me in. Hey. Fortunately, we cannot depart until the wind blows to the south. It would be a fatal mistake to set sail under an unstable breeze. I've heard legends of the tale of the wind god who once resided on this island. It is said that the winds obey his every whim. Have you heard nothing of him? I just talked to him. And I could have just sworn I adjusted the winds, but here we go. All right, to the south now. Nope. Nope. There we go. That was weird. When I tried moving it south, it went up. When I tried moving it left, it went right. Very weird indeed. All right, we good now? Yeah, I can climb in now. 
All right, and set sail. Whoa. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Ah, is that where the treasure is? Skirt. Salvage. I don't think we got anything. Wait, no. Get back in. Now let's try the salvage. And what's in here? This is the first time fishing for sunken treasure. You got silver rup rupee. 200? What's our cap? Oh, we haven't hit it yet. Is it 999? Is that our cap? I guess remaining so we don't have to worry about it at the moment. Hold on, let's... Okay, treasure chart is marked off. So yeah, we got it. That was barely a move. I thought I'm mad about it. And to the south we go. This way. Oh. Boy, hold it right there, small fry. A fish. I don't know where you got your mitts on that sea chart you got there, but it looks to me like it's pretty much got nothing but seas drawn on it. It's pathetic. In fact, it's almost an insult to call that thing a sea chart if you ask me. <laughs> What's the matter, small fry? I'm just trying to be nice here. I'm telling you, you've got a problem, and you do. Don't give me that stupefied look. It makes you look like you ought to be in diapers. Just listen, okay? I'm here to teach you what I know about this island. So open your sea chart and make it snappy. Here. Wait, I'm confused. There's a real particular cave toward the backside of this here Dragon Roost Island. Yeah, real particular. But I doubt you'll ever get to see it, small fry. Unless you manage to sprout wings and fly, that is. Because you won't be getting there otherwise. That's all I can teach you, small fry. You know what? I feel like I should take note of this. So I can make sure I can get towards 100%. Let's see. Cave on backside of Dragon Roost Island. Parentheses need wings. That's all I'll say about it. I will do this for you. Since I'm feeling so generous, generous, I'll send words to all my brethren living near the islands of, of the Great Sea. Good bunch of fish. If you see a fish leaping out of the water when you sail near an island, sail up to it and spread bait on the water's surface. Trust me, this is good advice, Fry. See, the baiting process allows you to get a chart of the island, along with any info that might be of use to you. I highly recommend you make a habit of doing so. See, you're definitely going to need a reliable sea chart to help you search for things out at sea. I can't emphasize that enough, Fry. You need a well-drawn chart. If you don't get a chart for every island you come across, it'll be a, a bigger hassle for you later on. Now. Don't say I never did anything for you, Fry. Ahoy. Oh, ahoy. Oh, boy, you there. The kingly red lion guy. That's it. I repay my debt. I'm done. You can take care of the rest. So, he was admitting to... Okay, you don't have to be zoomed in like that. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. We're going down here, but... 
This is just all up in the way. Okay, now it's cool. cool. All right. So he may have sound like he was doing a favor for our boat. Like our boat instructed him to do something like this. I'm pretty sure the arrow is just pointing the direction of the wind, right? Not to the island that we're supposed to be going towards. Oh. A little change on the compass thing got me. Ooh. Look at that volcano. We'll get there one day. Not today, but one day. Yeah, I don't know how we can get close to that today. I don't even know what stage of the game you are able to access that at. And I'm not bothering going up there. I don't think there's going to be anything useful for us. So we'll just keep traveling along. Travel, travel, travel. Travel, travel, travel. I did say I was going to cut at these points, but... Okay, yeah, I'm going to cut. What's up with this discoloration? Is it safe to approach? Salvage. Didn't even need a treasure map. I just saw it glowing out here. It's just another 200. No, it's 50. Is there a treasure map for all these or... And I just got lucky on someone on this one or is it just for some of them? And this is just one that's unmapped. I think this is where we're going next. Oh, it looks like it looking at the map. I like, at least on this version, how you can look at the map and still be sailing. I'll say that much. Yeah. No more cuts. We're here. I guess. It looks like two great trees looking at each other. It is now officially nighttime. I feel like the wind is weak right now. What is the best way to approach? Hey. Yes! Do you not see what rises up from the horizon? It's done been risen up on the horizon. This is where you must go, Link. The forest haven. Ah, oh, he landed for us! Now I don't have to figure out where I need to go. It's already figured. It may appear as though this is but a great tree rising out from the ocean's surface. But it is a sacred place. It is inside this grotto that you will find the spirit of the earth. The great Deku tree. You must speak with the Deku tree. And receive from him the sacred gem known as Afior's Aror's Pearl. I fear that Ganon's vile hand may have already reached this most sacred of sanctuaries. Go forth with caution, Link. Okay. I see this shop boat is right here, so... Maybe we'll check out what you got. Wait, what do you have? Oh, a customer! Welcome to Beatles! Uh, shop ship! I deal in great much anything. I deal in pretty much anything and everything. Do you have anything you don't need? If you do, show it to me. I'll pay top rupees for your junk. Or, do you have anything you'd like to buy? Let's see, bait bag. This holds bait. It's quite useful. And it's my very last one. You can't buy bait if you don't have a bag like this. All-purpose bait. So that's probably good for fish and pigs. Hi, au pair. You can't buy this anywhere else. Only on... Uh, here. I'm serious. Now's your chance to buy. Now's your chance. Bye, bye, bye. Bye. What is... What does it do? Here, I'll get this. 
This will be useful. You got a bait bag. You can keep plenty of bait in this convenient satchel. It has eight pouches for storing bait. Yeah, I know that part. You're the greatest! I'll never forget you! I'm going to make a member's card just for you. When you buy lots of things and build up your points, something good will happen to you. Something very good indeed. My shop is kind to its customers. No other shop will do this sort of thing for you. I'll have you know. You have, you now have one point saved up. You should try to save up 30 points so you can earn a silver membership. What happens when I get a silver membership? I'll go ahead and buy the all-purpose baits. You got all-purpose bait. Animals will be drawn to this gourmet pet food the moment you put it down. Has three portions. Choose your bait bag, yeah. Thank you. Yeah, thank you, yes, thanks to you. Now you have two points saved up. You should try to save up the- Yeah, I know, you told me that already. Let me see about this high -o pair. This might be a bad idea, but I'm gonna get it anyway. Because it just looks bad. But who knows, it could actually be really good. Special bait allows you to take control of seagulls? Woo! When controlling seagulls, tap A to flap the wings and accelerate. Press ZR to quit. No, thank you. Three points saved up. Yeah, I know. I'm a tenth of the way there. Bye. Come again. You said the bye, so I wasn't going to say it too. All right, well. I see a glowing patch out there where there's a treasure chest. But we're busy right now. Is that a person up there? You know what? Not important. Wait. I want to check the mailbox. Good evening. Welcome to the Island Postal Service. What do you have for delivery? I don't. I was hoping maybe you had something for me and I would do the postman job. I thought it'd be fun to be a postman. I mean, I had the bag for it. Hi there. Ooh. You got a Boku Baba seed. This is the source of the evil plant's magic. Perhaps you can find someone to cook it up. Its magic can be unleashed. Can I keep farming them off you? Looks like no. I mainly just wanted to end you, but you know, I guess this works. All right, to you. Don't worry, I'm not forgetting about you. I knew you were there the whole time. This didn't work out the way I was hoping. I'll take your seed as what? Well. You didn't drop a seed? What good are you? Yep, that's who they want, flip. Game over. Ha ha. Ha 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 about to say, where am I supposed to go? But then I decided, maybe I should look up. Oh no, oh no, oh no! That's not good. Guess we'll try that again. Wait, you just... I guess where I just saw him. Like, floating around the... I don't know. Let's try this again, hopefully with more success. Oops. Go ahead, shoot another. Yeah, I know how it works in the other games. Oh, one rupee? I'll pass. I'm not hurting for money right now. Or at all. I'm gonna go down here and defeat this one. Just because I can. Not because it's necessary. Who knows? Maybe it is actually necessary. Nope, it wasn't necessary at all. All it did was give me two rubies. Not necessary. We need to make our way into this tree. The funny thing is you would expect the great Deku tree based off of the first Ocarina of Time. I was about to say the first game, but let's be real. It's not the first game.
Wait, how do I... How do I go upstream here? Wait, was I on the right path going down here? Nope. Wait, wait. Wait. That's what I need. But yeah, you'd expect that the great Deku tree wouldn't be inside of this great tree. So this is one great tree, I will say. All right, get up here then. Can I reach from here? I cannot. That's okay, we can reach from here. Excuse me, get out of my way. All right. And let's get to swinging. Ooh, I can stand here. I say there's no curtain, but no, you can actually just stand. Hmm. What a nice, quaint little place. I can only climb up on the little waterfall. That's weird. Excuse me, it looks like you have an overgrown gla grass problem here. I'll go ahead and cut it down for you. And sorted. Oh, so sorted. I can't climb up on there either. Why can I not climb? There's gotta be some hidden around all of here, isn't there? You know, like a little hole that you fall down into and there's like a shop or something. There's so much grass covering up everything. Yeah, they won't mind me cutting the grass. It'll grow back pretty quickly too. Hello? Anybody around here? Hello? L Link is here. You make this light look like it's important. If you ask me, there's nothing special about it. Oh, good lord. Art read. Hollow's Forest Potion Shop. Hello? Are you in here? Hello? Am I not to be trusted yet? No, I think we gotta talk to the tree with the huge face. Huge, awkward looking face. His face looks like his best friend's name is George, and his name is Lenny, and he keeps mice in his pockets. That's right. Get off him! I could have probably handled that better, but I just got swarmed. I didn't know what to do, really. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Let me get all these goodies. Oh, it just disappeared. Back on him! Okay. Get off of him, you choo-choos. Choo-choo! Double hit! Wait, do they drop any choo-choo jelly? I'm gonna call it choo-choo jelly. I don't care if it's just called choo jelly. I can't understand you. I can't understand you. Um, can we try that again in a different language? I must apologize. I was in error. I saw your clothes and suddenly felt a longing for an age gone by. That longing caused the ancient tongue to pass my lips. I am the guardian spirit of this forest haven, the Deku Tree. I owe you my thanks for your aid in ridding me of those foul creatures. Tell me. 
Was it not the king of Red Lions, the boat who speaks, who led you to this place? It was. It was indeed. So it is true. And you have come here because you have need of the Pearl of the Goddess. I see. I knew there was a reason the monsters had begun to congregate in the regions around my wood. Now I understand it. He has returned. Ganon has returned. In that case, we must make haste. Kuroks, little children of the woods. This traveler is not your enemy. Let your, let your hearts be at ease and show yourselves. Oh, hey guys. What do you call yourself? Link? Well then, Link. Oh, well then, Link. These are the uh, Koroks, the spirits of the forest. I thought they were the ones talking to me. Once upon a time, long ago, the Koroks took on human forms. But when they came to live on the sea, they took these shapes. Now they fear people. But to me, they will ever be my cherished little children. As it happens... You have come just in time for a ceremony that the Kuroks hold, but once every year it is about to begin. I shall grant the pearl to you once their ceremony is complete. I must apologize for the brief delay, but if the ceremony is not completed soon, an ill fate could befall us. So let us begin. Are you ready, my children? But we are not a great Deku tree. Something terrible has happened. It is, um, Makar. Makar! What is the matter, Lindner? You and Makar are always late. N no, it's not that. Oh, great Deku tree. Makar fell into the Forbidden Woods. What? The Forbidden Woods? I told him to be careful, but Makar flew above the Forbidden Woods, and as he drew close to it... Foolish little Makar. Link, you have heard all this. Forbidden Woods is right beside the hollowed land island of our forest haven. Those woods, the whole region is a vile place that is home to evil beasts. And now it seems they have taken a child of the forest named Makar. Your presence here is no mistake, I deem. The King of Red Lions likely expects great deeds of you. It is why he brought you here. I am sorry to ask this of you, but can you go rescue young Makar from me? But Great Deku Tree, people cannot fly through the air. Ah, yes. Thank you, child. You are right. It is not possible to enter these wo those woods from the sea, is it? Link. I would guess from your size that you are heavier than my Koro children. Yet, I think we may still be able to solve this dilemma. You must use the item I shall bestow upon you and fly through the sky. All that to grow one rather large leaf. Hmm. Forgive me, Link. But could you climb up to my crown and get the leaf from up there? Uh, I can try. How would one transport themselves up? Would this work? Wait. The Forbidden Woods were once our home. They were peaceful back then. I would guess that our home sh should still exist somewhere deep within the woods. If you have trouble anywhere in the forest, just look for the stump-shaped houses. What do you have to say? Do you know about this flower? It's called a Bubba Bud. You can stand in front of it and just tilt L forward to jump on it. Bubba Buds. 
uh, Baba Buds have this particular habit of shooting you up into the air after you jump into them. So you can reach them, use them to reach, to jump up to harder reach places. Uh, keep her going. Beast. Nope. Oh. That's gonna hurt. Let's try it again. We just know that we need to stay on top of the tree when we get that one. Not try to go for another bud. A baba bud. Ba 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 boo. Boo. Landed it. Wow, you're quite good at that, Mr. Knight. Just keep doing that until you get all the way to the top. If you shoot out face in the wrong direction, don't panic. Just don't tilt your L in any direction. You'll land safely back in the Baba Bud. I can figure that out. Thanks for the ship, though. Wait, how am I... Where do I... Ah. Baba Baba Bud. And ah, I'm doing it. Oh no, freaking! You could be off by a little bit, and it'll actually amount to a lot. With that, I think it was just I wasn't really pressing forward enough or soon enough. I should have gone straight up and then came back down and tried going forward. Keep it twisting. All right, we're back here again. And let go. Forward. Please. Woo! Made it. You got the Deku Leaf. Set it. Uh, set it to and use with, yeah, the typical buttons. Plant your feet on the ground and use it to blow blasts of air at objects and enemies. You can also jump in the air and use your magic power to drift on the currents of the wind. Swordsman, over here. Or, oh. Please, you must fly over uh, over there to here using your Deku Leaf. All right, hold up. Items. Put it on the Y. There's nothing else I really want to use here. I really need to change up my cursor for recordings, at least. Look, it's the arrow. Oh, I'm using a magic. I was like, what is that beeping? I didn't realize I had magic. Very good, Mr. Swordsman. You've already mastered using the Deku Leaf. But since you, you're you so much heavier than we are, you can't fly very far, can you? How unfortunate. Well, anyway... This is the exit that leads to the Forbidden Woods, where our brother Makar is being held. Please take care, Makar. You got it, dude. Hold on, is there a heart in here somewhere? Like, it'd be nice to have a heart to replenish from the two times that I fell doing what you have asked of me. Okay, fine. I'll find a heart somewhere else. Oh, the place is rather spiky, isn't it? I think I kind of see what I got to do. Let's 
still not a single heart. Congratulations, swordsman. It appears you've finally gotten the Deku Leaf. That eerie looking island over there is home to the Forbidden Woods. Makar is trapped somewhere within there. You'll have to float over to the entrance from here using your Deku Leaf. But when you're flying with the Deku Leaf, you're at the mercy of the wind. If the wind can't carry you there, you'll fall into the sea before you land. If only the wind were blowing in the right direction uh, to carry you there. Yep. Make it to this island. This will be the halfway point. Please. Please. Don't let me fall. I'm guessing this tornado probably doesn't help push me up. It probably takes me down instead. All right, must restore. Okay, we're restored. Okay, I get it, I get it. There's magic in every one of these plants. There's no more rupees, no hearts, just jars of magic. Why is there so much? Hi, you. Nice job, swordsman. Looks like you've already mastered using the deco leaf. You're a quick study. First thing you should do is cut the grass around here to replenish your magic power. The entrance to the Forbidden Woods is on a much higher level than the entrance to the forest of our forest haven. In order to get up there to such a high place, you'll have to catch the swirling updraft. Can you see the updraft, swordsman? The updraft around here uh, move swiftly. So you have time to jump just right so that the wind will fill your deck relief and carry you into the updraft, giving you the lift you need. Once you're floating on high, just take the wind, let the wind take you to the entrance of the woods. Okay. However. Yep, that's all I need. Well, other than this wind. Can you hurry up and come back around? I need you. Or else I can't get high enough. Oh, it's almost here. Come on, please. No, please. Uh, I thought you were closer. Oh, that sucks. Let's try that again. Come on, give me one of the many jars in all these. They're not really showing me that there's a lot of jars. Stupid wind, you went around fast this way. And you were far out, dude. Yep. There we go. There's that updraft I was looking for. You're clear of the baddies. They're not good for your health. What did I just say? Is north not the right direction for the wind? You know what? We're going to jump over here instead. Coming around. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Do me well. Oh, you freaking failed me. Why is it so hard to catch? And why is there not a single heart in any of these? Ah, oh, freaking. It's like when it knows I want to catch it, it goes way out there. All right, when it reaches a little branch off to the side. Okay. Yep. Come on. Catch my drift. Nope. Stay away. 
and cancel. Made it. No, there was a heart I need. Please. Nope, I'm going inside now. I'm not sure I really have a good way to battle them. Forbidden Woods. Creepy. Very creepy. Wait, I need to hit you again? Green chew jelly. Uh, magical gelatin essence, but it can't be used in its current form. Yeah, I know. Haha, -ha, suckers. Really? Nothing? I'd like to restore this heart the rest of the way. Ooh. Ooh, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. That one had the goods. What do it is? Huh, that explains it. Stand up. I missed. What that fucking mess? I didn't. Who knew it would be so simple how to kill the thing on the door rather than just like to just throw the giant nut at it? All right, everybody stand up. Ah, nice little four piece. Let's open up the chest. Right, give me that good music. And we got a dungeon map. Let go. Ha, I got the choo choo jelly. Choo choo. Hold on a second. I'm kind of curious. Nah, I need like a boomerang or something. Let's see. So these ones are friendly. The red ones are not. going. Uh oh. I'm okay. I hurt a little bit, but I'm okay. Oh. Let's try it again, shall we? Mm-hmm. Perfect. Oh, I'm a little too short. Wait. That works. Now, send it back. No, other way, other way. No, what are you? 
thing is directionally challenged. There we go. What else I gotta do right here? These are obviously bad ones. Yep. Excuse me. Dude. So literally the sword does nothing to their heads. You're basically just bouncing the head until it gets tired, straightens out its stem, and then you cut its stem. Ooh, I see where. Almost didn't for a second there. Get back in. Nope, turn around. Keep a turn. This one's different. Yeah, it does nothing. Oh, look what we have here. It's a tough nut to crack. Turn, turn, turn. Limo, limo, limo. Let's try that again. I get it. Go ahead, drop your guard. Yeah. Yeah, 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 it's fine. You can protect that all you want. Easy. Fight is so simple so far. Platform's gonna move the moment I try to step on it. Move back. Thank you. All right. Back again. Once more. Ooh. Hope this platform can handle the weight of me and this giant nut. I guess I should go up here just to see what's up. Yep. There's nothing we can always just come back down. Wait, wrong button. Ah, that brings us back to the entrance, which I don't want to do. Bring the platform back, please. Thank you. Yep. 
All right, let's do this door. So far, I've accomplished nothing. So these don't hurt, but they're obnoxious. Do they hurt with enough of them? Yo, Rupio. I was hoping it was going to be a small key. So I'd know exactly where that goes. But nope! It's just pointless 10 rupees. Which I might need in the future. Who knows? As of right now, though, it doesn't look like I really need it. Oh, they made a little maze for me, I see. What? The throw just kind of like revved up on nothing. Ooh, chess. What's in the box? Compass. Now we can see where things are hidden in the dungeon. Let's see, we got a chest in here. A chest in here. Whole bunch of chests on the basement floor. And the fourth. The heck? So we're on the third floor right now. Hold up a second. I think I need to... We had busted it. That's all I was hoping for. Yeah. Figure you wouldn't let me go that way. Please let me get this money. It's not that important, but I still want it. I still think money collection is what ruined Luigi's Mansion 3. They made it so like it was a big thing that there was money everywhere and you barely needed it. All right, here's the other chest that's in this room. Small key! That's what we wanted. I guess I could say that. Yeah. <laughs> Made it. Wait. Really? I couldn't grab that? Oh, this isn't the right way. Um, here. Then we go around this way. Wait. This way. Door. Sorry, she shoes. I'm not interested. There's a lot of you. What the heck? Like I said, I'm not interested. 
Let's go ahead and boom. And then boom this way. And then what do you know? I have a key. Then this grass really does nothing. Can you let me blow you away? Oh, can I even be down here? Looks like yes, but it's weird. I don't feel like you should be able to survive. I feel like you should drown in that water. No! I can't get a good angle on it. It's hard to get a good angle on this ladder, too. Come closer. Closer. See, that doesn't help any. That was more difficult than it needed to be. Alright, go ahead and keep trying. Get off. That did nothing. Where am I going exactly? Guess I should go to this one. so long to wind up the leaf. If we go through those doors, are going to lead to something? Like something good? Boss fight? Uh-oh. It's a mafia guy. You stop making these spiky babies, nobody likes them. Gosh, that was annoying. It wasn't difficult, it was just annoying. I think that's the key for the boss room. I barely explored this place. This is really the boss room key. This was too easy to get to. Oh no, it's the boomerang. Even better. Target specific objects by holding the button, set it aim. Target up to five objects. That's what I like to hear. Okay. 
but that means item you go at X. And there are still three oxes to get on this level. Wait, I can't leave this door. Or can I? Now I can. Those flying things should be easier to kill now, too. Interesting turn of events. What? Yeah, jump. Yeah, right, I need to see about some things here. Wrong button. Yeah. That's like some money. Gimme, ah. gimme. Yeah. Oh, I missed miserably. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't realize you were alive. Pin the wrong button. No, let me out, let me out. I want the money. Give me the money. Wrong button. Again. Make sure I'll say that. And handled. Yep. All right, that was everything. Yep. I ain't in this room, but I messed that up. We get back up to that top level, go into the other room that we just opened up. Nice. Yep. Cool. All right, door. Holy. Ah, oh, dang it. What's the point of me doing this? Um, excuse me. Why do you only go for one and then come back? I don't think I could make it all the way around. Or can I? Hold on. This is dangerous, but I'm going to try it anyway. Oh, what if I... Ugh. I did nothing. What if I... Okay, I did nothing. Yeah, I think I'm at a bit of a loss. Come on, don't touch me. Ah! 
I'm done over here, right? Yep. I want to make sure there's nothing more to do over here, and then... Wait. Wrong button! Choo-choo jelly! I think I might have hit my limit. Ah, uh, there was one still alive. Get off. Yeah, there's nothing here that requires my boomerang. We're done on this side. Wait, all the choo-choos aren't coming back at me? I would have thought they would have responded. All right, hold on. Let me get to a reasonable place. All right, now. Oh, I can't cut this? You gotta hit them all. I can't get the best angle to hit them all, though. I'm thinking this might be the best angle. Come on, lift me up, booster. Up. Thank you. Up again. Thank you. And now. Boom! That's what I was looking to do. Now, with that, let's head back to the entrance. Shall we? Wrong button! Oh my gosh, shut up. All their voices are so annoying. And now we don't have to listen to them anymore. Let's head down here. We haven't been down here yet. Yeah, 500 is the cap. I wish there was no cap. Thank you. Oh, it's in here. It's money. Come on, can I? Oh, I can. Nice. Open sesame. Got an ice crest. Cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We've been over this before. All right, so that's the only thing that's down here. Fairy. Can I put this fairy in a jar? Save it for it later. Ha, I can. Sweet. We've got a fairy in the... Uh, bottle. When your life energy runs out and you collapse from exhaustion, this fairy will replenish your strength. Even though I'm holding it in a bottle against its will. I don't know. I feel like I'm kind of being inhumane. Yeah, it doesn't want to be in there at all. Oh, not my problem. Alright, now we gotta make our way back up. I can do it.
What is next? Straight across, it looks like. Ah! But I didn't fall off. Wait. This is how I want to do it. Mm -hmm. What's the point of the one on top of the stump? I don't see any good point for it. Guys, you just want to come back and fight me again? Do you not remember what happened last time? Man, I was kind of hoping for a magic jar. Oh, we can't die in here. No, there, there, there's no other level to go to on this one. Let's take a look at the map. So we're on the second level right now. We've explored the first. We need to explore the basement and get those three chests. There's one chest left on the third, two left on the fourth. That sucks. Set. Still nothing. It's not even worth me fighting all this amount that I'm doing. Ooh, that's worth it. Up. Uh, oh. There we go. I just went into the big one. Noise. I love throwing the sticks at them. It's fun. It's like hitting them in the face with their own brother's arm. I guess. Which does sound pretty messed up when you think about it. Wasn't worth it. It's not a pleasant surprise. I don't have any room for all that. It's just a waste of time. No, let go. Let go. Forward spin. No, no, this way. Perfect. I didn't go this way before, right? I did. I had to do that in order to go forward. Does lead to the room with the platform I just broke? It does! We're not going to be in here. No, not right now. There's no point. Go back this way. Wait a minute. I don't get it. Hold on a second. I didn't take any damage. Cool. If I look at this direction.
Hmm. Just wanted to see about getting back to that one room. Looks like it's a pipe dream. Let's not worry about it. Let's just go forward. I gotta fight you again. I had to fight your siblings. They all died and didn't come back. I still haven't found that uh, Korok yet. Yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know. All right, I think it's time to dip it low, pick it up slow, let go. Pop, pop, pop that thing. All right. And there you go. Goodbye to your eyes. Oh. Why have I been trapped in here? That's it. Oh, chess. You won't catch me complaining about that. But these things, yeah, get off. I'll complain about those. Why do they sound like bamboo when they land on things? Well, we won't deal with that for now. We gotta go elsewhere first. Before we end up dealing with all this. You know what? I'm not even gonna open all the rest. No, it's not worth it. I'm just going to run back to the other room and then drop down into the basement level. That's what I'm going to do. Hop! We're okay. What's this do? Oh, I see what it does. No, please! I get what you're supposed to do, I just don't want to do it. What is everybody here trying to do? There's so much to juggle right now. Can you guys like go down and not come back up again? Nope, they just keep coming back. So I'll just ignore them and move on with Link's life. Because I'm certainly not living mine right now. <laughs> uh. Wait. Uh. Get the chest, and then we'll break loose. Please stop giving me money. I don't have room for it. Give me things I can sell later. Or like a treasure chest. Oh. That was worrisome. I was under the thing. All right. Too short of a throw.
Are you kidding? Wrong button. That's what you get for messing with me like that. There we go. I have this feeling I could push that flower by using my leaf. Freaking! That's always obnoxious. Bad choice. Shouldn't have gotten close to me. There was nothing in it for you. That works. Uh, how do I get in there? Wait, there's one alive? Can't be out of that. Up, up. Oh, come on, Link. Boom. Huh. Everything away, let me crawl. It really needs to have its eye open. That's dumb. So yeah, basically I need to get this cage open if I'm gonna get it to open up its freaking eye. Come on, show yourself. What does this do? Yeah. Ah, that's what it do. Oh, I see what I gotta do. It'll be fun. Ah. Wrong angle. Ah. Not close enough? Ah. Yeah. Freaking. Ah. Word. Why am I struggling so much with this? Dude. Dude. What is going on? Freaking. This is obnoxious. Put it away. Go through. The fact I can't get this platform to move at all is obnoxious now that I got it over here. I forgot to pull out the leaf. Is that the sound of an enemy? Something other than the... Oh, are you freaking kidding? The thing on the chest? I hate the sensitivity of things like this. Like, just spin a little in one direction so this thing will move! Please! 
Yes, that way. A little more. 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 Holy crap, you're infuriating. Are we close enough to this one now? Nope. This is really obnoxious. There we go. Thank you. Why was that so difficult? That should not have been as difficult as it was. That'll do, pig. That'll do. This better be worth it. A treasure map. I guess it's somewhat worth it. There's nothing I can do to open. Okay. What's that clinking sound? Yep. All right, so. Yep. Go out here. Oh. Wait, no, this is where I came from, isn't it? I know what I must do. Oh. Boom! I knew I could push it along. Sailing on my little flower. Now you. Thank you. I feel like that will burn my flower if I had to run into it. So that's why I decided to cut this early. Seriously, push. There we go. Uh, 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 nope. So, how do we go about getting in here? One, two, three, four, five. I think I know. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. Ah. All right, that's the boss key. The big key. Use it to gain entrance to the room where the dungeon's boss lurks. Speaking of the map screen, is there any other chests I need to collect here? See, first level new, second level new, third level yes, fourth level yes. We can figure that out later. Hey, I just got a big hit on your friend there. He was still alive. Yeah. 
Yo, how much damage do you guys take? That one's dead. They were both just one hit away. Are you kidding me? Yay, door's open. You better have hearts near. Hey, heart. That works. Yeah, this is the most important thing to grab right now. All right. Wait. That's not it. Took the bars off of a door, but what door? That door? That door. Let's say, how do I get up to that door? Ah! Made it. Barely. But made it. Ah, this will probably lead me to one of those rooms with all the chests. No, never mind. I know where I'm at. Pressure. You more? Nice. All right. We're back to this place. Wait, why did that not work? I'm trying to figure out how am I supposed to jump up. All right, this way to the big boss room. I definitely want to go back in this dungeon because I'm definitely missing areas. I'm definitely breaking all these until I'm full on magic. But there's actually something that I need in here. In one of these. Freaking annoying. Gonna be one more group of them. At least. I'll take that. I don't need it, but I'll take it. Alright, in we go. I'll figure out about the missing chests and floors later. Maybe I'll do a half episode or something. Hi, dude! A car! Uh -oh. No, 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 don't, 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 don't. <gasps> How dare you eat my car? You're gonna pay for that flower. I was holding on only by one. Really? 
Come on. Got it. This is what you get for eating them. It's gonna spin me out. Yep. Keep on moving. What? Bruh. Two left. Got it. Open up. I don't care if it spits me out and does a little bit of damage. I can handle it. I got a fairy in a bottle. <laughs> Still holding on by one. And handled. I knew I could do it. That's right. Shrivel up. The car is safe. And this horrible flower is dead. Good. Sarsman, are you the one who rescued me? Yeah, my thanks. When all went dark around me, I thought my time on Earth was over. But why are you here, Swordsman? What? The Great Deku Tree sent you? Oh, th that's right. Today's the day of our annual ceremony. Oh, I'm in trouble. I shouldn't be here. I must get out of here immediately. Let's do that after I collect this heart container. Now we got five hearts. What is this? There's just lights underneath. Come on, Makar. Let's get out of here. We gonna get out of here. We gotta get out of here. I don't really want to stay. And we're free. Mm. Oh, Makar, you'll return safely. I'm sorry, Great Deku Tree. I know you warned us many times, but still I did not listen. Do not worry, Makar. You are safe now. Just be more careful from now on. You have done well, Link. I must thank you for your brave deeds. Here is that which I have promised you. Please accept it. But you guys haven't had the ceremony yet, have you? I thought I was supposed to get it after the ceremony. Does this mean that you guys are free to be able to go over to the other island now? You received Faora's Pearl. The Earth Spirit, the Deku Tree, has seen fit to give you this jewel. A treasure of the goddess Faor. Faor. It is my hope that this pearl shall lead you to a fair destiny. All is well, Makar. Do not cry. Please, play your songs for me as you always do. Oh, that's right. We must begin our ceremony soon, before the day ends. I'm sorry to keep you all waiting. Let the ceremony begin. Oh, Great Link. As my thanks to you, I shall play even harder than I normally do. I hope you enjoy it. Shouldn't you play harder than you normally do because it's a special ceremony? It started, it sounded better before they started singing along. This is how more, uh, 
Karak's are born. <laughs> that face. Great Echo Tree, this year you have once again sprouted some splendid seeds. With these seeds, we will continue to spread new forests across the Great Sea. Let's go, Karoks, to the sea. See you all next year. Take care. Farewell, Great Swordsman. May the winds of chance bring us together again someday. Ah, so they're going to do the opposite of what we do to the Amazon Rainforest. Good on them. That means that the Great Decker Tree has got to be alone for a long time. Every year, the Kuroks perform this ceremony. They fly off to the distant islands on the sea and plant my seeds in the hopes that new forests will grow. Forests hold great power. They can change one tiny island into a much larger land. Soon, a day will come when all the islands are one, connected by earth and grove. And the people who live on that great island will be able to join hands and, to and together creates a better world. Such is my dream. But the one you are chasing is trying to prevent that dream from ever coming to pass. Link. Already your fate is tied to the fate of the world. This world. You must proceed with great care. Okay. And I guess I should end things off here. So that's going to be it for this one. Thanks so much for watching. And until next time, when we get back on the boat and go somewhere else, doses. Link, look at the camera. Thank you. So I wrote it in the rhyme. The Reverend Doctor got an 8K wet working. And roaches get the race spray. My weak rhyme, my body, your best verses on game day. I touch the crowns of self entitled kings. You leave the heat like LeBron when I melt your idols, vital things. This is Malcolm and Martin, million man marching Sparta mixed with a legion of angels surrounding sons and daughters. Simon Peter with a desert eagle waving it at Caesar. So if I was you, I probably wouldn't mention me.